This morning, Wake Forest police issued a warning about missing monsters, Gila monsters like this one over here. They're venomous lizards, but it turns out the lizards are a different exotic reptile, the ones that are missing. CBS North Carolina's Carly Griffith is digging deeper to find out what's going on. He saw it sticking out its tongue and stuff, so he called me. He was like, come out quick. I don't know what this creature is, but I need you to help me identify it. Sadita Pandya says her father spotted a large lizard in their driveway just over a week ago. I didn't know if it was poisonous. I didn't want to like deal with it. Sadita did a search on the reptile and thought it could be a non-venomous Argentine tegu. The town of Wake Forest put out two news releases on the wayward lizards today. The first identified lizards seen in this Bowling Green neighborhood as venomous Gila monsters. The second release referred to a veterinarian that came to the same conclusion as Sedita. You don't see many of those huge lizards in North Carolina in your backyard. For some reason, this neighborhood has had multiple lizard sightings recently. This one was posted on the community's Facebook page on August 18th. Sedita has heard even more stories from neighbors. One said it was in their garage. The other said their neighbor thought it was like a mom and it had tons of children. Veterinarians say Argentine tegus pose no danger to the public, but Sedita says they'll at least be on the lookout for their dog's sake. In Wake Forest, Carly Griffith, CBS North Carolina. Well,